Okay, muchachos, today we're going to talk about um, stem changing verbs. Um, I wrote back up here the steps we went over on how to conjugate a regular verb when we were doing the AR and the ER, IR verbs in the present tense. And we talked about these three steps. So we first thing we do is remove the two-letter ending, and that gives us our stem. And then we identify the subject, and we add an appropriate ending. I added in a 1A here. We have to add in this extra step here when we have a stem-changing verb. Um, is to, uh, drum roll, change the stem. <coughs> so we have, once we remove the two-letter ending... and we have our stem there, then we need to make this stem change. Um, most of the stem change are gonna be simple, like it'll change of the E, there'll be an E in the stem, and it'll change to IE, or we'll have an O in there, and it'll change to a UE, or we'll have an E, it'll change to an I. Anyway, they're, they're just subtle one or two letters that we need to fix in there, uh, in the stem, and then we can add our endings to it. Now, um, let me write this in big, huge, bold, letters here in this lovely purple um, big asterisk here except nosotros so the nosotros form does not change we don't have to do a stem change there or just use the regular stem for that one okay um, so let's go through a couple of examples here and All right, so let's do the verb um, querer. That's a pretty pretty popular verb. That means to want. Now I'm gonna write a, a top, on top here, it's an IE. So that, you'll see this a lot on, your, on the vocab list. You'll have these little extra letters in parentheses there. And what that's telling you is that this is a stem changer and that it changes to an IE. So we're gonna change this E and we're just, actually, we're just adding in the I there, okay? And then let's do pensar. That's an AR verb. Uh, it means to think. And this is also an IE stem changer, okay? All right, so let's do our little charts here for querer and one for pensar. And then let's, let's go through. So if we take off the ER on the end, Oh, my stem would be care. That's my stem. And over here be pence. That is the stem we're going to use for the nosotros form. Okay, care. And over here we're going to use pence. Okay. But for the rest of the forms, we're going to use, um, we're going to change that E to an IE. So my stem would be quiere. 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 And quiere. Okay, and then this one would be pience, and then pience, pience, and pience. Okay, now those are my stems. I still have to add the endings. So then we check, this is an ER verb, so I'll go back to my, my chart, my present, when we went over the present tense of those verbs, and we're gonna change this to, or we're gonna add our endings. So the yo ending is O, so that again, my verb is, my action word is want. So this would be I want, is quiero. Quieres is you want. Quiere, he or she wants. This is, remember, is our regular stem, quer, and then we add emos to it. Queremos for we want. And quieren for you guys want or they want. Okay? Over here, again, it's an AR verb, so we're going to add AR endings. So we have pienso, which means I think. Again, this piense tells me it's the verb think. O tells me I'm the one who's doing it. Piensas, piensa, pensamos, we think, and piensan. You guys think or they think, okay? Okay, now you'll see on the in your notes here, I don't know if you can see that, this part right here. So this shows this the infinitive. Here's my stem. Uh, that's the regular stem. That's the one I'll use for nosotros. And then over here is my change stem, which will work for the other four forms, okay? 
So the regular stem is nosotros, the chain stem would be there. And then you would just need to go through and add the endings. But be sure and go back to the original infinitive and check and see. Okay, that's an ER, that's an ER, that's an AR, IR, AR, AR, IR, IR. So again, we're, we're checking to make sure we're adding the right endings based on the infinitive, if it's uh, AR, ER, or IR, okay? Okay, I think that's about it. There's two more verbs in your notes down here that I will go over real quick. Um, actually, let's do this right here. So I don't know why these got added in. So dormir uh, is a UE. So we see we have duermo and then poder, almorzar, jugar, costar, um, and then pedir and ser. Those are all stem changing verbs. I don't know why I threw in ver and hacer. I don't know. But if you'll notice that on those two for ver, notice that just the yo form is a little weird. You just leave the E there. So it goes veo. Um, the rest of the forms are normal. And then hacer, same thing. The yo form is ago, but the rest of the forms are normal. So I don't know how those got put in there. But they're probably on your test, so you probably want to study them. Anyway, I think that's about it. Okay, adios.